In this question, we are given if cos alpha plus 2 cos beta plus 3 cos gamma is equals to 0, sin alpha plus 2 sin beta plus 3 sin gamma equals to 0 and alpha plus beta plus gamma equals to pi. Then we have to find the value for sin 3 alpha plus 8 sin 3 beta plus 27 sin 3 gamma. Now see, using these two equations, we can write this as cos alpha plus 2 cos beta plus 3 cos of gamma plus iota times of add this that is sin of alpha plus 2 sin beta plus 3 sin gamma this will be equals to 0 because these both quantities are equals to 0. Now see we can write this as cos alpha plus iota sin of alpha plus 2 cos beta plus iota times of 2 sin of beta plus 3 cos of gamma plus 3 times of iota sin of gamma. This is equals to 0. Now use the identity that is if a plus b plus c is equals to 0 then a cube plus b cube plus c cube is equals to 3 times of a b c. So using this identity we get cos alpha plus iota sin of alpha whole cube plus 2 times of cos beta plus 2i sin of beta whole q plus 3 cos gamma plus 3i sin of gamma whole q. This is equals to 3 times of cos alpha plus iota sin of alpha into 2 cos of beta plus 2i sin of beta into 3 cos gamma plus 3i sin of gamma. Now use the de Marvelous theorem which says cos theta plus iota sin theta whole power n is equals to cos n theta plus iota times of sin n theta and also we have cos theta plus iota sin theta is equals to e to the power iota theta. So using these two properties we get cos of cos 3 alpha plus iota sin 3 sin 3 alpha plus now take this 2 common so 2 cube that is 8 cos 3 beta plus iota sin 3 beta plus now in this bracket take 3 common so we get 27 into cos 3 gamma plus iota sin 3 gamma this is equals to 3 into e to the power iota alpha into take 2 common so we get 2 into e to the power iota beta into 3 into e to the power iota gamma. So simplifying this we will get cos 3 alpha plus 8 cos 3 beta plus 27 cos 3 gamma plus iota times of sin alpha plus 8 sin 3 beta plus 27 sin 3 gamma sorry this is 3 alpha so this will be equals to 18 e to the power iota alpha plus beta plus gamma now see we can write this term as 18 into cos alpha plus beta plus gamma plus iota times of sin alpha plus beta plus gamma so from the left hand side and right hand side if we compare the imaginary terms so we get sin 3 alpha plus 8 sin 3 beta plus 27 sin 3 gamma this will be equals to 18 sin of alpha plus beta plus gamma now see alpha plus beta plus gamma this is given to be pi so this quantity this will be equals to 18 sin pi and we know that sin pi is 0 so this is equals to 0 so we get sin 3 alpha plus 8 sin 3 beta plus 27 sin 3 gamma is equals to 0 so 0 is the answer of this question now look at the options so option b is the correct option